All right, good morning, and welcome to Banjo-Kazooie the Jiggies of Time. We're picking up where we left off in the water temple. I really don't know what to expect here. Ugh, sure does bring back some nostalgia, though. The Water Temple is a dungeon that I personally feel always gets a bad rap. Like, I don't think it's the best dungeon in the series or anything. I think it's just kind of like, uh, kind of mid-tier. But, I mean, a mid-tier Zelda dungeon's <laughs> pretty darn good, right? And like, I don't know, people are like, oh, it's too hard, all oh, hard. Or the, I mean, it's definitely a difficult dungeon. It's the hardest one in the period of time, for sure. But, like, people, like, complain about the, the iron boots and stuff, and it's just never been an issue for me. I don't get it. Kind of like, you know, learn some patience. It's a little unfair, though, because I first played Ocarina of Time with a guide, so I knew everything that I had to do. The question was how to do it. Um, uh -oh. I don't like this. In subsequent playthroughs, it's, it can be easy to get lost in the Water Temple. But what I've learned has been to just do everything that you can do on a floor. And when you change the water level, start over from the bottom and do everything that you can do again. And if you do that, you'll... There's no way you can really miss too much. If anything. And use Far Wars Wind. Those two, those two tricks make it a very, very tolerable dungeon. Interesting murals and noticing them. I'm just concerned about like air down here. Because like if I drown, I'm gonna lose all my notes. Well, okay. I think we know what the solution to that is. There's definitely going to be a way to lower the water level, so let me let me just do that right away. Okay, it's not that one. I hear a Jinjo. Only, they're only giving me two ways to go. Yeah, this looks right. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Whew. Let's go check down a floor. It's commonly missed. Oh. I guess I just took that floor out. It's 
see what we got here. Fappenberger. Hmm. Wonder who that is. Eat them, oh, come. Excellent, excellent, excellent. It looks like there's gonna be no lowering the water level though. It's just a little stressful. Nope, nope, other way. Oh! Gotcha! Feeling some nostalgia for sure right now. Let's go check out Morpha's room first. Okay, this room, this room right here. This is my least favorite room in all of Ocarina of Time. By far. Well, for all their attention to detail, they should have made this one that you can only go up as a bird. Oh, it's Gamma! That makes sense. That makes sense. <laughs> oh, it's just... Uh, when you speed it up, it's just Mumbo. Slow down. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Jet Force Gemini. I have that game. I've never played it. I don't know anything about it. I know people mention it. I feel like I'm supposed to do something with that platform there. Take me out? Yeah, so let's go back in. Alright, so let's go this way. This is the way you go to get to Darkling. Yeah, of course. Because mm -hmm. we can't hook shot. Oh, I'm 
nervous about this. Oh! Wait. The fuck that kills you? Well, how am I gonna have enough? I feel like I want to load up my safe state. That really sets me back. I'm like, those notes are critical. If I have enough to progress. I feel like I need to save, uh, load up my save state. Yep, let's reload. Um, let's see. Sorry, I, I know it's cheatsy for this I'm because I'm trying to play it straight, but I just can't. I can't accept that death. I don't have the patience to go through this whole world again. Woo! 
Alright, buddy. Okay, buddy. Pull him. Take the cheap shots. Get it on our way out. Oh yeah, boy, 64. I mean, it's 65 now. <laughs> so it was a little late there. Game there too? <gasps> Super Mario All Stars! Nope. Don't worry, bro, I got you. Some people complain about the frame rate in Ocarina of Time. I've like never even noticed. I mean, I, it's 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 a 20 frame per set game or something like that. So I mean, it does have a low frame rate, but I feel like it's just animated so well that you can't even tell. All right. Please tell me there is surface up here. Yes. sure how to handle that. to the forest up like checking everywhere just to make sure you're not missing a letter. That was good. I, I, I really enjoyed the forest up. Okay, we're running a little on air here. doing here? Uh -oh. 
<laughs> That's right. That's right. Mm hmm. Preach. I wonder what that jump pad's all about. It's not like it can be used. Let's go up the other. Oh, there is no other. Like, oh. What do we have here? Phantom Hourglass. Oh, it's the, uh, the European version. Hi. Oh, that's right. I've got real low health. Gotta be really careful. I thought that was a dead end at first. I was like, shit. Oh, the exact place I was looking for. Getting those notes, because you never know, I could die again. Just want to maximize the notes that I have before that happens. Alright, let's go check out this area down here. No, that's the that's the way to the thing that changes the water level. This My guess is that there's going to be something that, like turns on a jet of water somewhere. Oh jeez, I really need eggs. I'm gonna get health out of this. What cost? That should be good. Stock up somewhere or somehow. Okay, before I proceed with the other three directions that I could go, actually make that one. See, I'm thinking I have to turn the geysers up, but I want to go back to. 
there's something that I didn't do that I saw last time when I checked up that walkthrough, I wanna I wanna do that. Cause again, I I just don't know how many how, how much longer I have before I die. There's the jiggy. Let's just go right for it. Got it. Uh-oh, but at what cost? Cheese guys! Leave a poor bear alone. Oh god, and that fish. So much for having health. There's some notes. So here's my thought. I'm thinking that I could, like, well, we never found a solution for this. I mean, that sounds like Flaker, doesn't it? We never found it. Just what I'm thinking. Still no sign of the pink ginger. The purple one. Nobody's in the water temple. Otherwise, it looks like we're gonna have to backtrack. Well, there's a lot more I can get from that now, apparently. Includes our uh, Long Long Park. Alright, let's do the thing with the frog things first. Since this requires health. Uh -oh. 
Whoa! Did not know you could kill him. I mean, I knew you could kill him from like a golden feather, but not by like rat a tat tapping him. Dangerously close here. Got practice. Cause I keep landing, right? That's next with Dark Link. But... Let's see this first. Oh, excellent. Because, like, if I die, I can do that, like, guy again. But I can't do this again. So, this could be it for, like, Helia. This makes me think of a uh, Super Mario 64. It's the like the spot where you get um I supposed to do that? Well, 92 notes is enough, right? We, we fought the good battle here, Dan. Supposed to have shot? Like, that doesn't make any sense. I want to see what's over there! This is where Dark Lake is! Guy, then. 
It's a little dangerous, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. So clearly I have to rat attack. Bandro Kazoo, you can like go inside a shell, right? What a sweetheart. What a sweetie. Oh. I looked up the walkthrough for this since it's on YouTube. YouTube like recommends more videos from the walkthrough to me and spoils location. So I think I know what the next two worlds are, and I think they're the only worlds left. Let's see. Here we go. the soundtrack available. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, well, you know, usually in the walkthrough there's like a, a like, time, a time stamp somewhere to show like when something happens. There's not this time, you see, so. Okay. 
Okay. So, they did the tower. Thanks for your patience at the end of this video. But, I can't just leave Blank Helia incomplete. Specifically thinking of the Jinjo. Okay, so now they should be going to Dark Lake's area. This, the purple Jinjos is not even going to be there. Okay, let me pour myself some tea from my lovely and uh, my lovely, amazing, and fantastic wife. What kind of tea it is? It smells like it could be cinnamon chai. We'll find out. Maybe it's a green tea. Ah, it is a delicious green tea. Okay, so let's go back over here. They did some advanced trick that I'm probably going to flunk. Okay, first, let's make this jump. You know, watch this. Oops. Look at that. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be too surprised because I watched them do it, but I didn't know I could do that. Alright, next room. Keeping an eye out for the purple ginger. No sign of them. Crabs are supposed to signify. <laughs> Look, they made the dragons cute. Oh. 
wonder if there's gonna be a dark banjo fight. Oh, <gasps> yep, there it is. guys from Click Clock Wood, I think. Missing is the Jinjos, actually. Well, that's a problem because the walkthrough isn't timestamped. Where the hell is the purple Jinjo? Here, I'm gonna look it up. My guess is maybe it's like in the is can I get back there? It's out, um, it's, it's at the entrance to Gerudo Valley. I probably, like, saw it in, um, probably saw it in, uh, my last play session. I forgot about it. Okay, this is, this is a key. coming back here because when they got all the jiggies in the video it looked like they were doing something else in here but I didn't see anywhere else to go but that will be then and this is now it's okay to miss anything just not Jiggy is in, or not, it's Jiggy's in. Just can't miss any notes or gingers. It bothers me that I can hear Clanker, but I can't find him.
Here's the Jinjo. Alright. Took a little screenshot of it. I kind of missed the good part of it. But. So, how many tickets do I have total? Because I think I needed like 14. Alright, clear. Let's see. 15! Oh, excellent! Well then, let's open up Girdo uh, Fortress and call it a day. Man, I wanted to play more, but I don't have the time. Oh, wait, are we satisfied here in 99 notes? Wow, I wonder what I missed. Oops. It is amazing how much difference the good CRT is. Oh, fuck, fuck that guy, fuck him. Got all about him. But like, as I was saying, like... It looks so... Like, when I see, like, gameplay footage and, like, um... Like, like little walkthrough that I looked up and stuff. It's like way too um it's way too sharp. There we go. Way too sharp. High death. Whereas like it looks perfect on ice cream. actual song that they're going to use in the Gerudo Fortress. I don't have a problem with it. Like, it's chill. It's just, like, surprisingly low-key for a banjo song. Gee, just imagine what this level's going to be like. It's a good fit for Banjo-Kazooie, isn't it? Disappointed, I probably won't see the spirit temple though. Okay. This is what I'm very intrigued by over here. Of level I've already been to. 
wonder why. Now I have, now I have nothing. I guess I've got red feathers. Alright, I think we can save and quit on this. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. I'm looking forward to when I'm next day able to play. I'm sure Gerudo Fortress is going to be pretty intricate, but also pretty fun. <laughs>